All right, so jumping back into the kitchen, this time with the lovely Angie Boyd, and we're making something rather interesting. If you're gonna raise an eyebrow mm. at this one, well, maybe yes, because I did when I first heard about this, but apparently it is delicious, but we all know that Cake and vegetables, they're two food items that really just don't mix, okay? So we've got carrot cake, there's beetroot cake, even sweet potato cake. But how about vegan zucchini cake slices? Angie? Yeah. Really? Why not? Why not? <laughs> you got me there. <laughs> if you can add carrots, you can <laughs> add Why zucchini. not? Okay, so what's the deal? Why does it work so well? Um, well, it works. I mean, the zucchini is actually quite a neutral flavor, a little bit like carrots. You know, that you're not really going to taste the zucchini, yeah. but it adds that health factor. Okay. Uh, these are vegan friendly. So, you know, we've taken the recipe and then we've got to change it around a little bit. So no eggs, no dairy, nothing like that. Right. No butter, you know, no milk, no yogurt. So what we've got is we've got some sugar. All right. Which is perfectly fine. We've got some cake flour. Just your normal cake flour? Yes, okay. and it's a very straightforward recipe. It's a little bit like a muffin mix. Uh, and then we've got some soy flour. Now, the soy flour is actually your egg replacer. I see. So it boosts the protein content of the recipe, because now we don't have the eggs. Yes. Um, and then we've got a little bit of coconut flour as well. That just boosts the starch content. And then we've got salt, bicarb, and baking powder, because it's got a rise. It's got, <laughs> it's got a rise. <laughs> um, so that's the dries in one bowl. And then very right. straightforward, we just mix all the liquid ingredients in another bowl. So I've got some mashed banana. So it's actually quite a healthy, it looks a bit weird, hey? It's got, yeah. We've got some water in there, some mashed banana. Um, so it's fairly healthy. The banana yes. also boosts the protein and the starch content. Okay. Um, and we just mix that together. And then we've got some canola oil. Okay. You could use olive oil as well if you wanted yes. to make it super healthy. Okay, but uh, if you use olive oil, you'll get that. You'll get that flavour, which, which actually well. goes which rather nice, well with, with the courgette, zucchini yeah. courgette baby marrow, same thing. Yes. Um, and then we've got a little bit of lemon zest. Right. That adds, and then fresh lemon juice. So lemon and zucchini actually goes extremely well together. So it's almost got a really faint lemon flavour. Yes. And you don't you don't honestly taste the courgette or zucchini. I call it courgette. <laughs> well, you know what? It's eggplants. You know, aubergines. Same aubergines, thing. all the same, same thing. thing. Yeah, right. exactly. Okay. Um, very into. What have you done with your courgettes? Uh, Grated to, them. To kind of just kind of, did you cook them down first? No, or not at all. Raw like so that. So they're raw. I mean, they're quite soft. You can actually eat them raw. Okay. I often eat them raw in a salad. They're beautiful. All right. So um, liquids into the dries. So it's a quick mix method. Okay, so you just kind of throw everything in together. Throw everything in together. Lovely. And then once that's mixed through, so these have just rinsed the courgettes and then finely grated them. All right, there we go. And then we just chuck that in. So it's kind of like green. Looks My healthy. goodness, yeah. And I'm so I'm so keen to kind of try this, you yeah. know, because it's different. I love carrot cake, I love the sweet potato cake, beetroot yes. cake I've tried as it well. It all works. Yeah. Uh, on that note, if you want to get your hands on this rather interesting recipe, something maybe you haven't tried before, but definitely adding a health factor to your baking, <laughs> being it vegan and there's courgettes in there, SMS the keyword cake to 33728. That's cake to 33728. That will send you everything you need. Thanks, Yun. Is that <laughs> it? <laughs> that's it. It that's feels perfect. like we should be mixing more. No, though. that's it really is that straightforward. <laughs> Goes into a tin, baked at 170. It takes about an hour to bake though it does and yeah. it has a slightly denser texture because of the courgette in there yes you I know because it understand. is quite moist so uh, and then we've topped it with some coconut icing such so as coconut milk icing sugar um, and, a, and a little bit of toasted coconut easy as that I love it vegan courgette cake slices try that out the keyword is cake SMS that to 33728 and you really came to surprise us this morning with a rather <laughs> interesting recipe really appreciate it <laughs> so different. check it out on our website as well expressoshow.com everything will be loaded right there for you <laughs>